Good morning, second grade. How are you? I'm over here in the picture book section of the Westmere Library and I have several things behind me. Can you see any of them? So I have a dog, not a real one. I have a llama. I have a, a whale. I think I can put them here. I have a, a rabbit. I have um, Clifford. I have um, a fish, help help fish. And, and I have a tree, I have a tree right here. It's not a green tree, but if I plug it in over by my computer, it lights up all sparkly. And if you look at all those things or think about all those things that I've just showed you, which ones do you think you could use as, um, or you could have as a pet? Okay, can you have a whale as a pet? No, I mean, you could go someplace like SeaWorld and see them, right? And you have a llama as a pet? I suppose if you had a farm, you definitely could have a llama as a pet. Can you have a rabbit as a pet? Yeah, you can. You can't have Clifford, but can you have a dog? Yep. I don't know that you'd want pout pout fish, but you could have a, a fish and I got a, golden retriever dog behind me. I'll put that right there. And then, and then I have this tree. Can you have a tree as a pet? What do you think? Well, that has something to do with today's story and something to do with continuing to share books about our environment and Earth Day. Um, so what do you think? What would you choose as a pet? Maybe you already have a pet, a cat, a dog, a hamster, a guinea pig. In that pile, what would you choose? Well, Today's character in the book chooses something very different. So move on to the next slide and see what you think. See you in a minute.